In terms of the clinical development of drugs for hepatitis B, what would you say to the patient community? Well, first of all, uh, um, I would say that people and, and patients need to be aware that there's a lot of uh, drug discovery effort, um, a lot of um, uh, clinical uh, research uh, being, um, being done currently. There are many drugs that are in, um, in clinical trial evaluation uh, today. Some are um, direct acting antivirals, so trying to um, inhibit the viral life cycle at different steps of replication. Uh, and others are trying to um, uh, boost the um, uh, immune responses, the host immune responses against the virus. And for, for these two categories uh, of drugs, we, of, of drugs we have, we, we have uh, quite a variety of, um, uh, of compounds and medication that are being, being um, evaluated. Uh, we have uh, drugs in phase 1b, drugs in phase 2, which is uh, already extremely good. And we heard uh, from some companies that uh, there might be, maybe next year, uh, uh, a drug uh, going to phase three clinical trial. So, which is which shows that this is a very dynamic field, um, which is progressing. Obviously, there are, as always in uh, uh, in clinical development, there are drugs that are failing, uh, and some drugs that are progressing from one phase to to, to the other. So, the the process is. It's a little bit slow, but this is a, uh, a normal uh, uh, process for any type of, uh, of disease. So, um, so I would really uh, the other point is that we are at a stage where we have so many assets, different targets, different drugs for, for ta different targets and so on, that um, the, uh, the main question is now how, how to combine these drugs in, in the best manner mm -hmm. to, to improve the uh, the functional cure rate, yes. um, and this is now w where we are. Uh, obviously, we, obviously, we don't know what would, will be the best one, and, and, and so on. But we we are in a situation where we can be hopeful, um, uh, knowing that there are, there will be some failures, um, and there have been already some failures. But that's part of, of the. Uh, let's say the, the usual game in in drug and, and clinical development. So the the uh, what we, is important for the patients' community is to to know that there are, there's a lot of um, uh, ongoing uh, research for uh, drug development, um, and that they should stay in 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 the clinical management with their doctors to to be aware of the latest uh, development. Um, maybe participate, be enrolled in clinical trials to have access to, to innovation as early as possible and to follow this development and be uh, part of, um, of the uh, uh, new treatment uh, uh, process uh, and really keep, really keep in, the, in the loop of, uh, mm -hmm. of the medical, medical care uh, and really be maintained in that uh, uh, in the care system and, and be followed regularly for, for, their, for their disease, make sure there will, there will be no complication of, the, of their disease, and also uh, be aware of the, uh, of the new, new development and, and have access to innovation as soon uh, as they are available. That makes perfect sense. Good. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you very much.